Hello and welcome to the vlog week three. It's snowing here in Chicago and I am, oh, it is a lazy, lazy Sunday, but I have managed to get myself out of the house. I'm going to Whole Foods, I'm getting ingredients. I'm gonna make this mushroom risotto tonight. So then I have it for a few nights and who knows what else I'm gonna get. I didn't bring my trolley dolly, so I can't get too much. Yeah, it's actually not that cold out. It's just a little bit snowy. So, um, yeah, it's the beginning of my week. Finally doing it. Finally making the mushroom and pea risotto. With risotto, you can't, like, leave it. So I'll show you kind of what I have going on here. Have the mushrooms and peas. I just sauteed the mushrooms, added the frozen peas. These I'm going to set aside, and I think they're pretty much done. I have the risotto going. I have a little bit of an onion because I forgot to get a shallot. <clears throat> Adding the broth one bit at a time. Stirring it in. And eventually this will look super creamy without any cream. I mean, eventually I'll add the Parmesan, but this is by the way, the um, risotto that I use. It would taste better if I actually had a little bit of white wine, but to like put it in the risotto, but it's okay. It's still gonna be good. You just like have to tend to it the entire time. I will link a recipe below. It's not what I'm, I'm doing like a variation of it. You can kind of like mix and match with uh, risotto. Just kind of get a good idea. But it does take patience and you cannot multitask. It's not possible. So I need to stop recording. So I have the day off of work and I have nothing planned. So I decided to schedule a massage and it is a 43 minute walk. I've decided to walk, I have lots of layers on and as long as I'm not running late, I can show you some views. I know you love Chicago views. This right here, by the way, is Ogilvy train station. I actually go to that train station to take it up to my parents' house. It doesn't take long at all. And in front of me here is um, Union Station takes a bunch of other places and this is the loop in Chicago that is super empty because lockdown. And I'm about to show you the Civic Opera House which again closed so train stations fight so loud. So yeah, this is the opera house. And I'm headed to the gym uh, to either do a Peloton uh, cycling class or a walk. So if the bikes are available, I'm going to go on the bikes. If not, I will go for a walk. I'm so excited because I got a delivery and I think it's from TikTok. So when I did their, I'm part of um, the Creative Learning Fund on TikTok for my digital speaking coach account. And they reached out to me. And so I've been a part of this since mid-December. And they did like 12 days of, I'm getting my shoes on, my Uggs. They did 12 days of giveaways. And I won a $25 Target gift card, but I also won TikTok swag. I don't know what's gonna be in this box. It's not that big, but I'm really hoping that there's some of the TikTok swag because I'm probably, that I like because I'm probably gonna wear it. <laughs> It'll be a little embarrassing, but I don't care. I'm a TikToker, so I'm gonna go get this now and I will show you uh, what they sent me because I have no idea what it is. TikTok. 
I have no idea what's gonna be in here and I realized it was a giveaway. I just, <laughs> I don't know. I kind of had a feeling there would be a hat, but I don't, I don't normally wear hats, but I'm going to. Oh my God, yes. This is gonna be like my undercover look. I'm just gonna wear my TikTok hat. Yes. Well, I have to adjust it. Oh man. Oh, this is good. This is really good. I'm gonna go for runs. I'm just gonna wear my TikTok hat. Once I figure out how to adjust it, it doesn't work when you have a button in, but whatever. You know where I'm gonna wear this? Is when I go to um, my pool. I'm sure I'll make a lot of friends that way. Oh, I'm definitely using my TikTok swag. That's for sure. <laughs> oh, oh, this is cute. I mean, it's a TikTok t-shirt. I really love this. I'm gonna wear my, hold on, hold on. There we go. There we go. And, and we have a cute tote bag, which I can bring this to the grocery store with me. I've never been so excited about swag in my whole life. Um, and then we have this TikTok water bottle, which will probably go to the most use. Yes, I love my Amazon water bottle, but who can go to the gym and have a TikTok one? How many, how do I open this? Not many people. <laughs> and then a little TikTok sticker. I'm gonna put that, where should I put that? I wanna figure out where to put the sticker. And I also don't use stickers, but it's great. So let me, let me give you the full look, full look. I mean, really, like, this is amazing. I'm very happy about this. <laughs> I am, oh, it's Friday, by the way. I don't even know the last day I blogged or vlogged. I am going downstairs to pick up a package. I don't know if I told you, but FabFitFun reached out to me and asked me to be one of their influencers. And I've never ordered FabFitFun. And so my box is here. I can't show you yet what's in it because I have to wait till February to post, but I'm like really excited about it. Um, they found me on TikTok. So yeah, it's like really cool. So I'm very excited about it. Also, Random Things is also on TikTok. I had a laser company reach out to me. So I'm going into a dermatologist on Wednesday to get my first treatment. I don't know where, if it's my stomach, my butt, but um, yeah, it's like, it's I'll, I'll keep you posted on it, uh, but it'll all be on TikTok but I'll still tell you because it's in my vlogs, Avi. Um, so yeah, really excited about it. I Tonight it is the feels like is nine degrees right now in Chicago. I have not been outside in like two days. Tomorrow night I'm going to dinner, but I am not going outside. I ordered Thai food last night and uh, I will be having those leftovers for dinner tonight. Thank goodness for the air fryer. My crab rangoon will reheat so well. So very much looking forward to that. And I'm already hungry for dinner. Um, so I'm going to try and wait a little bit, but we'll see. Uh, I'm rambling. So this is really cool. You can order plants when you just like scan the QR code and then order it through the app. It's really cool. It's Saturday and my friend Amy just came over and we had, we had coffee. Uh, up on the roof, indoors, because it's super cold out. And now, where is it? I am going to, you know, you're getting like a tour of my apartment. Um, I am going to make these skinny taste bagels that require like five ingredients, it's supposed to be healthy, and I'll show you how. I've made them once before, so let's, let's hope they turn out. It was a cup of flour, all-purpose flour, three teaspoons of baking powder, some kosher salt, and now it calls for a cup of Greek yogurt, but this is seven ounces, so we're just gonna go with this. The oven is um, preheated, and now we're just gonna add the yogurt to this and then roll it out. So I rolled it into a ball and then split it into four different quarters, and then I'm gonna put these into balls, form them into bagels, put them on here. 
I ran out of everything but the bagel seasoning. I had a tiny bit, so I sort of sprinkled it. Then I put these flaky sea salt on it. So here are my four bagels and they're in for 25 minutes and then they have to rest for 15. I think my oven gets hotter than it should. So they're a little bit yellower than I wanted, but we'll see how they taste. Um, they have to rest for 15 minutes. In the meantime, I'm cleaning my bathroom and I'll, yeah, they don't look that attractive. I promise you they come up better normally. I saw on TikTok that you should cut a bagel like this. Hold on, you can see what it looked like. So then you get more, but I wanted to show you the inside. Look, it's like chewy or doughy. So we'll see how it tastes, but I'll link the recipe below. They're really good, by the way. That flaky sea salt really just added something. Did you give them a shot? I haven't been outside in quite a few days. It's not warm out. I'm all bubbled up, but still. I uh, decided to go to Whole Foods and I don't need, well, I need to get stuff, but I'm just gonna get a few things, get some lunch, and that's about it. Also, I am editing a Dudley Stevens video that I shot before Christmas, but I'm finally getting to it, and I'm hoping it'll be up. Maybe I'll post it tonight. I think I can get it done by then, yeah. So, it's coming soon. I am ready to go out. I am dressed up. I'm wearing this sweater from Cezanne that I got a while ago, and I've gotten so much use out of it this year my faux leather commando leggings, my Amazon earrings, an old ring that was a gift from my aunt, and a bracelet that I bought at some point during quarantine. I am running, I'm not late, but I'm like exactly on time, so I'm gonna get going. I also got a new phone case, I'll link it below. I'm very excited about it. Thank you for watching the vlog. Uh, share it with your friends if you think they would like to find it interesting, and I'll see you next week. Bye.